If you want more episodes, please like and subscribe. Okay, all right, everybody, quiet down now. Okay, that's all right. All right, get it out of your system. All right, ready? Three, two, all right, that's great. Listen, it's great to be a kid and keep talking, but I, uh, we have to start. Oh, well. All right, uh, walkathon. Who knows what a uh, walkathon is? Um, okay, let me explain. Walkathon, you walk, you collect money. Um, you collect money for walking. Mm hmm. Mm. Walking by you. Sounds like a big W-O-T. Definitely. <laughs> What's that? It's a waste of time, Mr. Lynch. Oh, clever. That's a little uh, whatever it's called. It's an uh, A. <laughs> uh, Thank you. But I'm talking about walkathons here. I haven't told you the part that makes the whole walkathon thing good, okay? It is for the homeless people. What's, What's that? that? There are people that are homeless, obviously. Homeless is the uh, adjective, people being the noun. Right, so uh, class, uh, we have to collect as much money as we can to help the homeless, but uh, the most important thing is we have to beat those fifth graders, okay? Beat the fifth graders. Collect more money. They always collect the most money, and I hate them. Mrs. Jackson's class last year, actually, you know what, for the last four years, has collected more money. They are no longer winners. We are the winners. Who's the winners? We are. Who hates the fifth graders? You. No, no, class. We all hate them. Who hates the fifth graders? We all do! Right on. Mom, that's a 50! Yeah, and? <laughs> Is that too much? I don't think so, Brendan. There's plenty more where that came from. Or at least there will be. Meaning Meaning, meaning what? I'm going to get a raise. Oh, that's great. Well, I mean, I'm going to ask for a raise. Well, that's practically great. Because things have been going very, very well at work, and I think it's time to strike while the iron's hot. Mm. Or, or it'll get cold. Yeah. And you can't strike cold iron. No. Can you? I, I don't know. But, 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 Mom, if you want me to go in and play your crippled child, I will. Just... I might not even need you to, Brendan. Oh. So that means... Uh... Yes. We're going to have enough money to get the kitchen remodeled. Oh. You know how I hate the kitchen, Brendan. Have you thought about talking to the kitchen and telling it how you feel? You know what might be fun? Let's pick out some counter tile that we can both agree on. Nope. See you later, Mom. No, you can't. Yes, I can. No, you can't. I think I can. I don't think you can. Yes, I can. Why I see. NYC. Why I see. NYC. If you doubt me, I will grow stronger. Brendan, you cannot win a walkathon. All right, team. Coach McGurk has to run a little errand right now, but uh, keep practicing until I come back. Where are you going? None of your business. Uh, on second thought, who wants to come with Coach McGurk to identify a body? Anybody? Anyway, you know, like I, I told him, you know, walkathon. Yeah, I'll do that. You know, sure, but a runathon? I wouldn't do a runathon. You want to see an eight-year-old have a heart attack? <sighs> hey, uh, Brendan, you have a couple of bucks for gas. You want to kick in here? Um. Uh. Look, I'll get the gas, but that's it. Look, I'll get the soda, but that's it. Look, I'll get the bagels, but that's it. Look, I'll get the pants, but that's it. Hey, what is 15% of 39.50? Just move the decimal, Brendan, and then add 15. What the hell are we doing? I'm supposed to be at the morgue identifying a body. Well, he's not going anywhere, Coach. Why? Coach, you have to keep practicing. I'm cold. I'm always cold. Me too. <laughs> I have a thyroid condition. Is that true? Yeah. That's cool. I wish I had one. Will you hold me? Um, because I'm freezing. Everybody's looking. I don't care. Everybody's looking, but I don't care either. Let him look, because hugging is great. I love to hug, too. <laughs> look, everybody, we're hugging. We don't care. We're cold. Oh, wow. Yuck. Man. It's weird seeing a dead body, Brendan, and it's weird, yeah. weird seeing it with you. I kind of feel like I shouldn't have brought you here, you know? I mean, you are eight, and... No, I'm cool. All right. I'm cool. Just don't tell your mom that I brought you to see a dead body today. Oh, yuck. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Man, is he ugly. Coach, do you know that guy? Hey, Brendan, you don't have to whisper. He's dead. I mean, look at him. Yeah. Who is this? It's my Uncle Pedro. That's my dead Uncle Pedro. Yeah. 
Did he just wink? Man, Brendan, that was weird, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Believe me, when you get older, this uh -huh. is going to disturb you. Right. Not that I'm not totally disturbed now. Yeah, I'll tell you something, Brendan. Life is funny. Didn't know the guy at all, you know? It's actually the first time I met him. Yeah. It's like when some movie opens, Brendan, and closes in the same weekend because they didn't advertise enough, you know? Yeah. Then you hear the movie was crappy anyway, so you didn't miss much, right? Right. But was it crappy? You know, I mean, yeah. was it? You don't know. Right. Because you didn't see it. Right. Huh. I guess you left trying to figure it out is what my point is. Yeah, it's weird. It just doesn't make sense. Yeah. I guess a lot of stuff doesn't make sense after you've seen a dead body, you know? Hey, Brendan, do you think what I'm thinking? Man, this movie is crappy. Yeah, you're telling me. Hey, Brendan, I'm putting you in charge of Operation Popcorn. Aye, aye, Captain. What? Oh, my God. Oh, no. What? Oh, man, I spent all the money. Well, go pass the can around and then bring back popcorn. All right, everyone uh, put your homeless money in the barrel. Here you go, Mr. Lynch. Uh, very good, Melissa. Well, that sounds like a lot. It's about four dollars. Fantastic. W Whoa there, Brendan. Uh, what did you just uh, dump into the barrel? Um, nothing. This isn't money. Uh, th these are rocks. I'm uh, I'm aware of that. You gave the homeless four rocks? Actually, three. Three rocks. But the homeless don't need rocks. What are they going to do with extra rocks? Eat them? <clears throat> no, Brendan. What they need is money. Now, didn't you collect any money? I, uh, I guess I, I didn't. Oh, Brendan. I know. I mean... Brendan. Yeah. It's it's all right. It's all right. Some people are better at collecting money than others. <sighs> yeah. But don't let that discourage you. Here, I won't. Look, here's here's ten dollars. I'll just put ten dollars in the barrel. Oh. This'll start you off, okay? Now let's let's see if we can't collect more money for tomorrow, okay? Yep. Okay. Okay. Okay, that goes for all of you, class. Uh, we need more money here. More money so I can beat those fifth graders. Because we want to beat who? The, the homeless. No, the the fifth graders? Come on. Fifth graders. And who are we putting money in the barrel for? You. you. Who do we... No, no, no. The homeless, everyone. Who do we like? Homeless. Okay, just the ladies. Homeless. Yes. Brendan, do you feel like doing a role-playing game? Oh, no, I'd rather just do nothing. Well, in this one, you'll be my boss. Um, okay, if I film it? Oh, the camera makes me nervous. Oh, come on, Mom. Look, look, we'll watch the tape and we'll critique your performance. Okay, just let me change into something else. Mom. Where's my boa? I actually have that downstairs. Okay, th this will have to do. Okay, here we go. Okay, um, all right. Oh, wait, wait, what's your boss's name? His, his name is Arnold Lindenson. Ooh, ouch. Okay, give me a second to get into character. Arnold okay, Lindenson. Uh, okay. Uh, okay, I got okay, it. Re ready? Thank you for seeing me, Mr. Lindenson. Call me Arnie, please. Okay, Arnie. I changed my mind. Call me Mr. Lindenson. Now, why am I here seeing you right now here in this office? Yeah. I wanted to talk to you about my current financial payment area. Whoa, wait a minute. You're going to say that? I'm going to clean it up a little bit, Brendan. Uh, let's try it again. Okay. All right. Um, now then, why are you here? Because I'd like my raise now, please. That's weird. More, more confidence. Okay. Okay. Mr. Lindenson, I'm asking you for a raise. Good. How much would you, would you like? 20%. Ha! Done. Put it there. Mr. Lindenson, thank you. Now get out of here, you goose. Thank you, Mr. Lindenson. All right, cut. Okay, how'd I do? Um, well, it needs work, but you know what you got going for you? It's called the pity factor. Uh-huh. And I felt sorry for you, and I just wanted you to have that raise. So that was good? Yeah, that was good. How did I do? Uh, not so good. You know, maybe I should meet him so I can do a better job imitating him. You don't but... want to meet him, Brendan. Oh, uh -uh. why don't I want to meet him? But he has this weird energy about him. Cool. Juliet! 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 Are you there? Okay. I have several instructions. First, I'm leaving for the day. I have I have one instruction. I'm leaving for the day. Okay, here's what I'm doing. I'm leaving for the day. Okay, I want you to clean this place, all right? I want you to clean it. Not so much spick and span, more span, okay? Here's the system. If yes, then don't answer. It's a system, or it could be also referred to as a code, okay? Do you understand the system? Nothing if yes. We'll start the system now. What? Hello? You didn't just right now say anything, did you? Because I was talking a lot, so maybe I didn't hear what you said. If yes, say nothing. Nothing? Nothing is what I'm hearing, Juliet. Oh, is that a yes, Juliet? No. What did we say no meant?
Uh, hey, coach. Uh, hi. Uh, I'm uh, wondering if I could possibly be reimbursed for that uh, little road trip we took the other day. Brendan, where's the fire? I told you you're going to get it, right? Well, yeah, I know, but uh, I could get in trouble here, so, hey, you Brendan, know. what are you, the mob? Huh? No. Are you the collector? No one. Are you the no. IRS? <laughs> can I please... Are you the tax man? <laughs> no, can I please have my money? Give me some space here, Brendan, all right? Well, I'm just, you know, it's, it's been a few days, so... Well, I happen to be in a cash crunch right now. Well, yeah, no, aren't we all? That's... Are you thinking yeah. I get paid well for this job? I don't want to answer that. The point is I don't. Okay. Well, um... I'm on a teacher's salary here, Brendan, and uh, I guess the government has decided not to pay teachers well. Yeah. Because they're doing the most important job in the country. Right. We can do this all day, but I I'm in danger of getting in trouble, and, you know, just... Oh, man. Hey, you know what? What? I'm supposed to go to a will reading for my dead uncle, the guy you met. What, Uncle Pedro? Yeah, remember I introduced you? Yeah. That's right. So, you know, I'm sure there's some cash coming my way. If you'd like to come, you could probably collect. Huh. You think of what I'm thinking? I think so. Road trip! Well, um, first of all, of course, uh, my condolences. Right on, man. Yeah. Um, and this is your son? What? Oh, him? Uh, me? Yes. <laughs> yeah. No, I don't think so. Not, oh. uh, not this guy. Oh. If this was my son, I'd yeah. kill myself. <laughs> <laughs> I'd yeah. kill him, too. All right, shut oh, up, Brendan. You shut up. Okay, then. Okay. All right. All right. So let's get this started. Yeah. Hey, Brendan, let him handle it. Hey, look, I need the money. Well, uh, okay. Okay. Um, let me get right to business here. I don't know if you, uh, knew this about your uncle. He was a very successful sausageer. That's, that's, uh... You know, one, one who uh, makes sausages. Wow, I thought what I did was embarrassing. And uh, he did make a very comfortable living. And he, in fact, mentioned in his will uh, that he wanted to give you the family business. Oh, yeah? Uh, though he reconsidered. He did, however, leave you something that was very, very dear to him. Something that he had hoped you would um, cherish as much as he did. Uh, here it is. His last remaining sausage. Enjoy. That's it? That's it. A frozen sausage? Mm hmm What about money? Um, afraid not. Well, give me some money. I, I... That's why I came here. I'm sorry, that's, um, you're looking at it. He left me a frozen sausage, that's what you're telling me. A frozen me. sausage. So... So, my, uh, secretary will see you out. Thank you for coming. Oh, my life. <laughs> Sir, this is vintage sausage. Take a look at it again. No, I will not look at that. Look, I'm doing you a favor. Take this sausage and get the hell out of here. Just give me ten bucks. Five dollar. Seven. Six dollar. I ain't giving this for six. Get the hell out of here! Look at it! Get out of here right now! Uh, send in whoever is my next person to see me, please, Juliet, please. Send them in, please. Oh, hello? Oh my god, are you okay? <laughs> Fantastic! What, because I'm covered in bandages? Well, yeah. Now, what brings you here, Mrs. Small? Well, I've been huh? I've been teaching here for about three years now, Mr. Lindenson. Huh? Teaching here for about three years now. I'm afraid you're going to have to speak up. I was just saying... Bring it up. Mr. Lindenson... Lock it. Lock I, it down. I, I've been teaching here for about three years now, and I think that it's uh -huh. about time... Uh-huh. ...that... Well, no. No. Paula, please, don't belabor it. Spare change! Spare change! Not for me. For, uh, for a walkathon thing. Anybody want to donate to a walkathon thing you over here? Hey, we got... hey, you. Hi there. You're on my corner. This is my corner. Oh, no, no, no. It, <laughs> it's not like that. It, it, mu it must look that way. But you see, I, uh, this is uh, for you and uh, your, your people. Thank you. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. I certainly wish it were that easy, sir, but no, I have to walk some amount of miles or something first, so it's totally impossible. But there is a number on this can that you can call if you'd like to complain. Spit it out, Paula. I want to raise. <laughs> Come on, seriously, why are you really here? Is the self-defense class next door getting too loud? Well, actually, it is, but that's not why I'm here. I'm here because I want a raise. Oh, 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 no. You cannot have a raise. Raise for you? Not happening. Not now. No way. I'm afraid not. I'm frightened not. 
No rays! Yeah! Are you sure? Oh, I'm I'm more than sure. How much were you going to ask me for, if you don't mind? 20%? <laughs> Are you serious? 12%. That's more like it. Really? If we were really talking here, sure. 10%? Done. Really? No, I thought we were just doing a thing. Oh, boy. Like a raise shtick. Like a routine about getting a raise. <sighs> okay, this is, this is not great. Hey, come on, look. I'll tell you what I'm going to do, Paula. Paula, mm -hmm. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to do, and then I probably won't do it. I'm going to talk to the rest of the board. I'm not even familiar with the board, but I'm going to talk to them. And I'm going to see what I can do about the volume problem with the self-defense class next door. Now, what do you think of that? Huh? <sighs> How do I look, Father? Oh, son, not so good. You were crushed by this wall here. I'm, I'm afraid you only have a few more minutes to live. Oh. Well, that sucks, Father. Yes, it does, yeah. my little lamp of God. Yes, it does. I suppose you're here to give me my last rites then, huh? Yes. Hold on there. I'm <clears throat> trying to reach my wallet. Oh, no, my son. Last rites are free. Since when? Since always. Let me give you something at least. No, it's really not necessary. Please, let me just give... Well, anything you could spare the church would be greatly appreciated. <clears throat> That wasn't too tough. Is there anything, my son, that you would like to confess before you die and go to hell? What? Heaven. Sorry. Oh, um... Um, offering you a chance to be absolved of your sins. How do I know you won't go blabbing, though? Well, you sort of don't. So what are you saying? What are you saying? What are you saying? What are you saying? You know, f forget it. I'll, I'll confess. All right, hit me with it. Chop, chop. Well, I accidentally stole some money once. Oh, dear. From who? From a charity. E you're kidding. No, no I'm, I'm afraid I did. I was young, naive, I, I really didn't know. Hey, everybody! Whoa. Guess what? What are you doing? This guy steals from charities! You know, please don't. I know! Please don't do I that. I couldn't believe it either! Please don't do that. That's never, we never got one like that! Hey, please. All right, I'll check you later. Thank you. Man, no wonder a wall fell on you. That's bad karma. Wait, hold on, please don't believe in karma. Did, wait, what are you, Catholic? Actually, I'm um, Jewish. But I thought you were a priest. Yeah, I, I do get that a lot. Yeah, but you're dressed like a priest. Yeah, it's laundry day. I'm down to my priest outfit. Look, buddy, I got a split. Hope everything goes well with the wall slowly crushing you. Eyes. To understand no. what you're trying to say in your writing assignments. Eyes. Okay, Fries. you can go on thinking the words are spelled the way you think, Fries. but people like me will be able to understand. <laughs> Look, Paula, I wanted to apologize about how I feel like I came across the other day. Don't bother. It, it's okay. No, no, no. I think I might have been a little discouraging when I, I didn't mean to be. See, I was feeling a little irritable because I was and still am in a great deal of pain, Paula. I hear that. Okay, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. But I have been thinking about what you said. You mean about my raise? What raise? I asked you for a raise the <laughs> other day. What did I say? You laughed and said no. <laughs> that sounds like something I do. Absolutely. That's me up and down the line. But no, Paula. I've been thinking about the other thing you said. You know, remember the volume problem with the self-defense class? Right. And I'm afraid that I couldn't do anything for you, and I'm sorry. Yup. You heard me. I'm sorry. I am sorry, and I am sorry about that. But I would like to make it up to you. Do you like Italian food? Yes. Here, take this. I couldn't finish my lunch but it's pasta or something, and it's still warm. What are you talking about, Mr. Linden? Take it, Paula, please. It would make me feel better. Whatever you say, Mr. Linden. I'm going to be honest with you, Paula. It's really not my pasta. Uh-huh. I think it's hospital food. <laughs> oh. Hey, Brendan. Brendan, wake up, my little lemon cake. I brought you some breakfast. Yeah. Brendan. Oh. oh, thanks, Mom. Oh, boy. Hey, this is great. What time is it? Oh, my God! I missed the walkathon! Oh, no good little walkathon skipper, son of a 
gun, that little redhead smart aleck, that little red schoolhouse. That little wop bop a loo bop a lop bam boom that little tootie fruity, that little... Hey, I got my quarterback. I guess the kitchen isn't going to be remodeled anytime soon, Brendan. We hardly use the kitchen anyway. Mom, don't exactly answer right now, but I have a little proposition. Oh my god, what a crappy movie. Weird old fool dies, leaves me a sausage. Not money, a sausage. His money is something I could use. I have to eat this repugnant sausage because I have no food. Sausage is probably 18 years old. This thing could vote. This thing could go to war and die for its country. Oh, my sweet heaven. That is... It's incredible! Hey, save some for me! Yeah.